so till now we have seen in last video that uh, uh, there were uh, eight steps to convert a active audience into connecting community so let us uh, see one by one in this the first one after uh, five chapters uh, in the first so this is the sixth chapter the, let them take a shot what does it mean let us see big crowds draw people in when you see a large crowd of people hovering around uh, something around something your natural in instinct is to find out what's grabbing their attention and you can use this instinct to engage your audience create a crowd and get people to look your way and join in people will come back to continue conversations they have started with each other once they are in they are in and they are going to want to keep these conversations going especially if they are getting notifications every time someone replies to a thread and with the uh, social media platforms rewarding engagement you are going to see more people discovering your content and interacting with it as a result the crux of this strategy is to ask your audience for an answer even if you already know it yourself now you might be worried that uh, by asking for an answer it may seem like you don't know the answer yourself that's not true you are simply allowing your audience to talk among each other which you may find to be valuable not just for the reasons above but because guess what your audience likely knows a thing or two you and the rest of the community can learn from each other and have healthy debates about things your role is to foster a safe environment for this to happen one that would be hard for people to find elsewhere this will help people feel like they are a part of something they can relate to not just because you are there creating the environment to allow this to happen but because people are now able to find people who are just as passionate about the topic as they are or more just for fun ask your audience on social media it does not matter what your target audience is this question which one is healthier kale or spinach if you wanted to grab a little bit more attention attach an animated gif along with it you are going to see people uh, scramble to give you their best answer many of them so scientific that you will know they spent a half for researching on wikipedia some people however will give you only one word answers and that's to, that's okay too because they will still feel like they have a voice and that's really important to belonging you are giving them a reason to use that voice these conversations always work best if you choose to choose a topic that's related to your audience but it does not need to be that way here is an example of one of the engaged posts on instagram in terms of uh, number of comments and likes in the shortest time period this strategy is beautiful because it is about letting people in and uh, allowing them to tell a uh, part of the brand story it's like uh, inviting your entire audience into your right writers room where they can share their opinions on where the story should go and connect with each other in that process of storytelling it also works really very well when you ask people to answer a question that doesn't have an obvious correct answer with the walking dead's instagram team asks 
the shows uh, followers to decide how the show story show story arc should go they are not looking for a right answer by making the question intentionally ambiguous with no clear answer they are going to speak people to engage understand up for why they think one outcome is better than the other the next strategy takes the let them take a shot method a step further by allowing your followers to play a more active role in your brand and actually help influence your next steps that's right it's time to let them decide let us see one exercise here for this strategy that is um, see what is like to give your audience a chance to take a shot step number 1 on your favorite social media account ask a question that you already know the answer to it can be related to your business but it does not have to be if you can support the choice with an image or video even better step number 2 don't take it too seriously experiment have fun and see what works best for your audience so for more inspiration and examples to help fuel your audience participation let us see in the further videos this is what uh, the sixth chapter uh, that is uh, let them take a shot so you are involving in though you know uh, answer you are involving your audience to participate and give multiple answers so that's it